We're doing a little review of the laptop here. So we're starting when he was shedding his velvet. This to us was the holy grail of our trip at this point. And then this moment happened. Dagger on the left, BB in the middle, you remember him, bear bait. This was the day of the bear bait incident. And of course, flat top, chewing on his velvet there on the right. Trying to engage in a three-way sparring session, but flat top got busy with his velvet raking and BB and Dagger continued to spar. You have seen some of this footage before, but we're also including some that you haven't seen. Flattop couldn't help himself. He had to rejoin Dagger, but Dagger's just a little bit too hot here, so Flattop lets BB take over. Let the kid practice a bit. Burn some energy. This is always so enjoyable for us to watch when an older bull mentors a younger bull. It's pretty special. The antlers are all new to them at this point. This is their brand new set for the year that they've just rubbed all of the velvet off. They haven't had a chance to use them. Try them out, if you will. So sparring is a way for them to test drive their new weapons and practice their fight moves. The bull behind flat top here is Spot. Now everybody's shedding their velvet. Thanks Spot. It's red with blood, but it's not hurting them. And this was the epic morning that we watched Swagger back down from flat top. Oh, oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I was pretty amazed. But here's what's amazing. Watch this. That was exciting, and of course, it wasn't as close as it looked. This is the day we witnessed Flat Top cementing his place at the top. He obviously dug a rut pit, and he had some action. Fast forward to one of our more recent fun little encounters was this day that Flattop and his lady friend and her little bull calf were being pestered by a younger bull. Just because she doesn't have antlers doesn't mean she can't hurt somebody. Cows will punch out, striking with their front feet, and it can be deadly. She just wants this little pest gone. She's not going to hurt him, but believe me, if she wanted to, she could. Beware an angry cow. Well, I'm saying. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.